Hi, you guys. Today's question has to do with motivation. How do I get motivated for my workout and how do I stay motivated for my goals? Um, well, it's really not about motivation, you guys. It's more about discipline. If you're looking to be motivated every day or every week or whatever, it's it's going to be really difficult to find because people can't motivate you. You know you have those people in your life that are like, let's do it. Let's go to class. Let's go out for a run. Let's do this or that. And you're like, no, uh, I don't want to do it. You know, and you maybe you do it because you want to be a good friend or because you know that you should or whatever, but you're not really motivated. So let's put motivation to the side and talk about discipline. Discipline is a word that a lot of people don't like because it makes it sound like I'm forcing you to go do something that you don't want to do. But if you have made fitness a part of your life where you are looking for that motivation, then there's a reason why you made that part of your life. You have a set of whys and maybe you haven't revisited that list in a little while. So today I want you to grab a piece of paper and a pen and I want you to write down your whys. Does it have to do with not being a burden on your family as you age? to be able to play with your grandkids on the floor, to be able to cut the grass without feeling winded? Does it have to do with the race that you're training for? Or that you just wanna feel better, you wanna look better? There's a million reasons that you have possibly for your why. So revisit that list when you're not feeling super excited about getting after it that day. And please tell me, please tell me that you are putting yourself at the tip top of your list because you're worth it, you deserve it, and it's good to feel good so that you can continue to spread your love and happiness and example out there for everybody to follow. So, okay, make your list and get on after it. I'll see you in the gym.